What's up, guys? Uh, it's Kenyo here. This is a uh, Aikido adventure. Uh, mukbang. <laughs> Can you call just anything a mukbang? If so, I have uh, two hamburgers deconstructed. No, no buns at all. No buns. Um, they also said that they had separated everything out, um, which they did. There you see onions and pickles. It's nice enough to provide utensils and four packets of mustard. So I guess, and we said no ketchup, so I guess this is what you get when you say, let me get two hamburgers, four in total. I think the onion proportions are probably on point. I think you did a really good job. But uh, I guess it's only a mukbang if I actually eat it while I'm recording. Huh. Okay. Well, it's not a problem. That was my plan all along. So, there's the mustard. I'm going to get some of these onions. I was just going to put my hand right in the onion, but then I said, let's be courteous. Let me use this fork. Wow. You have cheese. Where'd you get cheese? Yellow cheese from. The dryer. Okay. But it doesn't taste good. Oh. Well, I'm going to go cheeseless then. On the first one, at least. Okay. So I assembled, I don't know if you can see that very well. I'm recording this on my MacBook camera. I'm hoping that I can make MacBook uh, cameras industry standard. Just joking, just made that up. But there you go. There it is. Yeah, a close up. Looks, looks great. Got onions on it. Now it's the time. Of dining. So let's see if this is how this goes down. This is not usually how they do it. She must have been confused. I think they were confused, you know? They were just like, you know what? I don't know what you're really asking me for. Have I'm going to go above and beyond. There it is, guys. It's a little keto snack. Keto. McDonald's snack. I don't know the facts about McDonald's foods, but it's all right. I'm not going to die. Immediately. Whoa, 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 buddy. You're going crazy with the onions. <clears throat> Sorry. I don't know how I developed take ups. Probably because you took two bites for a whole bit. That might be it. That might be it. Um, just need some, some paper towels over here. I'll do the body well. Okay. Anyway, as you can see by my voracious attack, of it's pretty. It's pretty uh, tasty. Let me get a little a little dabble of your cheese. You don't mind. Uh, some cheese going down, some cheese action going down over here. 2 a.m., but it's Monday. That means it's. Uh, I was going to say hustle day, but that was really bad sounding in my head, so. Bad sounding coming out, too. Yeah. Well. Hustle day. I kind of think of Monday, you know, because like Monday starts it off. There's a temptation to go slow, and you kind of have to sometimes on Monday, but really it's your chance to set the pace. So if you burst off with Monday, you you can actually coast on that for the rest of the week. But anyway, there you go. There's the um, there's the 
There it is right there. Let me get you a close up. There's some weird cheese right there. Um, mustard, pickle, onions on a standard McDonald's hamburger patty right there. It's going straight in the straight to the dome. Without any hesitation. It's pretty tasty. Cheese. More cheese. Oh thank you. I appreciate it. Mmm. I don't know what to say, guys. It's a classic. Four hamburgers, four bucks. At the 2 a.m. hour? I mean, sure, we can live in a city where there are all kinds of fancy options, but at the end of the day, a well targeted McDonald's. Anyway, that's enough. my napkin. I'm going to do a thumbnail. <laughs> With the food. Yeah, kidding. It's going to be an empty, empty plate thumbnail. <laughs> it's a little big. I don't know why they do that on mukbang. You could just literally just edit that part out. Hey. Hey. Okay. I guess it's fun. It's like a segment. I think shows are good with segments. I think on hashtag goals, we should have um, like segments like, oh, all right. So in this part, we ask every single person this question, you know, like every entrepreneur, this question. Yeah. It could be the dating question. That's a good one. That could be a segment. Yeah. And we could have like music that comes in the segment. Who you dating? Oh, see? The mukbang isn't over. I just got some scraps to finish off. I feel like to someone out there that this might look like it's gross, like someone handing you scraps and you're finishing it. It's not know. scraps. I, I mean, was using a fork. Okay. Partially constructed meal. Have you ever Try when... Uh, have you ever... Where's the man? Right here? Yeah. Have you ever when walking out of a restaurant seen... Um, an unfinished plate on someone else's thing and be like that or walking into a restaurant where you see like l the someone like leaving a heady and they like left food or been tempted to grab something off of a plate and eat it mm. um, that one time in Miguelitos when we first walked in there was like a bunch of this, like fries that nobody ate and I was mm -hmm. just like ow crap no, I was like, oh crap, but I was like, oh, like I could probably like eat those, but I wasn't really going to do it. But what I say is more so I see it like, cause I used to be at hotels a lot, like mm -hmm. when I was traveling yep. and like people always leave a bunch of food outside of like room service. Like they put on like carts and stuff or they put it on the floor mm -hmm. for people to come get it. And it's usually a lot of food on there. Mm -hmm. Have you seen that YouTube video where that guy goes by and like gets all this food from like plates left out from room service. That's what I'm saying. Like, I think there's a whole, gross, there's a whole thing like, to do. It's not gross because number one, a person probably coughed on it. And then, yeah, like, but do we really care? That happened I on, did. it happened at the, in, the chef did it. Chef probably if I, did. If you do you that, know what's going on back there in the you, kitchen. You nuke it in the microwave to get the germs off of it. Like, if you had a microwave in your room and you really just didn't have any food, and then you saw like some yeah. eggs and sausage left over. You could just nuke it in a microwave. I think you're underestimating stomach acids. Well, my stomach acid don't work like that. <laughs> it don't. It it's, yeah. it's not enough. No, know. you're right. You're right. It is. There is. All right, guys. If you like this video, like it, subscribe. Oh, well, that's true. The mukbang is over, guys. For every day video. It, oh my gosh! <laughs> now, <laughs> now there's a link. Anyway, see you guys.